it takes a second to realize what's happening in this painting and who it's representing. So this is actually a painting called Magdalena Ventura and her husband and son. So yes, this is a painting of a woman. And she was a real woman who lived in 1631 and she was actually quite well known at the time. A duke commissioned this painting because he had heard of her. In the painting, there's some writing in Latin that explains that she was 52 years old at the time that this was painted. So it's pretty unlikely that she actually had just had a baby at the time, both because of her age and also because if she had enough testosterone to cause the beard growth, it's pretty unlikely she would have ovulated. Uh, so it's probably artistic license to show her femininity, her motherhood, um, and her identity, despite the appearance of her beard and the receding hairline, other features that look very traditionally masculine. And there are medical conditions like polycystic ovarian syndrome or congenital adrenal hyperplasia Plasia, which can cause excess facial hair growth in cisgendered women. And so it's a very important lesson to note that facial hair and other external features do not determine your gender identity. Gender identity is internal and it's personal, and it's not something we can assume just based on how someone looks.